It's time to square off against the giants confronting our nation. Inflation is out of control. A $30 trillion federal debt. Medicare is insolvent in just four years and Social Security insolvent in 11 years. Illegals are pouring across the southern border. Crime is rampant and liberals are assaulting our most cherished and fundamental values. America is desperate for new leaders who are fixated on liberty, who are not willing to just kick the can down the road anymore, and who will stop doing what's expedient and do what's right. For years, Republicans have won elections but refused to truly face our nation's giants. Our leaders are putting self-interest above the national interest. Winning elections is meaningless if we lose our nation. I'm Josh Burkeen, fourth generation rancher, I'm a committed Christian, committed husband and father, and I've operated a small heavy equipment and trucking business. I grew up learning the value of hard work, cleaning horse stalls, breaking colts, and hauling square bales. I served as the state president of the Oklahoma FFA Association, and I was fortunate enough to serve under United States Senator Tom Coburn as his field rep in southeastern Oklahoma for many years. I know about Washington's games. Washington corrupts the newcomers subtly converting outsiders into insiders. I didn't play this game when I served in the Oklahoma State Senate. I confronted it. I stood against the status quo, I stood against the special interest, and I led the fight against Common Core and against tax hikes. And like Dr. Coburn, I honored my term limits pledge. Your children and mine deserve better than we're getting under this president and this Congress. I want my kids and your kids to grow up in the America we've enjoyed, the greatest nation the world has ever seen one bursting with freedom and hope and opportunity. It can be that way again, but only if we humble ourselves, do what's right, and get involved by electing leaders who have the courage and wisdom to make the tough decisions needed to course correct. I'm not running for Congress. I'm running to reform Congress, and I humbly ask for your prayers and your support.